Welcome to BIT 350 Operating Systems. I am your instructor, Jared Bernard. I'm glad to be with you. I have been teaching for over 10 years uh, IT and technology courses uh, at several different colleges. I'm glad to be here at Midland teaching this course. Um, I have taught cybersecurity, Linux operating system, Windows operating system, server administration, networking, and several other courses. Let's go ahead and review this course uh, so you know what to expect. If you log into Canvas, you'll be opened with this home page. If you scroll down a little bit, you'll see an introduction. There's my name and a link to email me. The best way to reach me to ask questions, to um, if you just want to have some time with me and to meet with me is to schedule some time by emailing me. Uh, the next thing I would have you do is read the course description. This explains a little bit of the topics and things we will be covering in this course as well as clicking on this link here to review the syllabus. Now let's dive into the course a little bit so you know what to expect. In this course we will be looking at operating systems. What an operating system is, which is software that makes your hardware usable for the user. So we'll talk about um, file systems and CPU allocations and how that software interacts with hardware and different how it stores things on on uh, your partitions and your hard drive. So we'll look through all those type of topics. We're going to be using a tool called MindTap from Cengage. One of the first things you need to do is go to the Start Here section, click on this link here and sign up for MindTap and find this BIT350 operating systems course on that site. That is your textbook. That is where all your exercises and quizzes and activities will be for this course. So go ahead and do that first thing. And then once you have done that, you can go ahead and read through week one resources. And then here are your linked assignments for this course. Each module or each week will also have a quiz. So make sure that you do that. And um, we hope you enjoy this course. Again, if you have any questions about the course, feel free to send me an email. Thank you.